one of the biggest actions that they can take against fighting climate change. Active mobility, getting cars off the street, getting people onto soft mobility modes, whether that's e-bikes, scooters, walking, anything like that. That's a that's a thing that we really need to push towards. Providing for greater shared use paths, better intersection design, bike lanes in some areas where we have the cycling numbers either now or in the near term, not necessarily a hundred million dollars for bike lanes. And to realize what that does across Edmonton when administration was bringing forward the bike plan and determining how much is this actually going to cost? If council wanted to get it done within one budget cycle, it was going to cost double that. We need to talk about what these bike lanes enable. They allow children to cycle safely to school in the morning. They allow families to go out for dinner in the evening, go to community centers participate in society without the prohibitive cost of owning and operating an automobile. We crunched the numbers last night and it's almost $13,000 per year when you take all the costs of car ownership into consideration.